Syntec Multi is our multi-parameter site solution. So this could be environmental or farming applications. The Multi itself comprises the da data transmission unit depicted here, plus numerous inputs that can be added into it. This includes two probes, um, two temperature inputs, and two pulse inputs. If I just open up the actual interface, these inputs are plugged in on these green plugs here. So starting from this side are these two plugs over here. Okay. Now these are four wire plugs into the 485 interface of the probe. The examples used are normal Enviroscan screw cap probe and the Enviroscan flat cap probe. But these could be the drill and drop probe or the Easy Ag probe. The interface is the 485 logging multi interface, which means that the actual probe interface controls the whole system. And all the programming for the FTP sites, the data, the modem is actually done via the interface board on the probes which also log the data. Okay, so the first two, as mentioned, the probe inputs. The next two sensor inputs are the RTD1 and RTD2, and they temperature. So this could either be two soil temperature sensors, buried at whatever depth you like in the soil, or two air temperatures here. This, this one is inside a Stevenson screen, which is a scientific standard, or, as the system is set up, one of each. One in the soil, one in the air. So again, we could have multiple depths in the soil, or you could have two hearts in the air, depending on your application. Okay, the final two inputs here are your RG1 and RG2, which are pulse inputs. So they can be a rain gauge, they could be a little irrigation gauge, or even a flow meter. So you can have a combination of any two of those. The modem transmission, is via CDMA, NextG, GPRS, or satellite. This one in particular just has an example of a small little antenna, but you can also mount a bigger antenna and mount it even on a raised pole, depending on your needs. The system is powered by a rechargeable battery, and the battery itself is recharged by a solar panel going through a regulator on the board here.